Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Daniela Paco, your health coach and nutritionist. And in today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you my three inexpensive diabetic friendly foods that I put in my kitchen and I cannot do without them. Stick with me while I share, share them with you. First and foremost, as a diabetic, you feel that it's a death sentence or it's something that you feel that you uh, cannot have a control over that is a life of uh, regimented living or eating well i am here to let you know that it is not like that as a diabetic person or if you have been diagnosed with type 2 diabetes or any form of diabetes i just want to let you know that you can have a control over it through wholesome life and functional eating and i am here to put you through my life as from my own personal experience and how I've been able to overcome it. So let me quickly dive back into the video and share with you one of the things that I cannot do without. The first one is my apple cider vinegar and my lemon water. These two things are very important for you when you know that you are going to be having erratic insulin spikes. Why? Because this thing here see right here it's a, 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 an insulin desensitizer it helps with your reduced insulin resistance especially when you eat a high carb diet so all you need to do is put a teaspoon of this apple cider vinegar into your warm water and take before your meal or after your meal or you can start with your lemon water just squeeze this into your water and take and if you know that you buy them in bulk like i do you can buy them and freeze them up i just brought this out because i know i'm going to be showing you a video of it you can see it's yellow because i squeeze them up and then i mix it with turmeric and put them in the freezer i freeze it and then i bring it out to cool and then i put in my water this thing is very good right here and if you have a good power supply just do them in bulk and freeze them freezer bring them out and use together with your warm water secondly is my cinnamon cinnamon powder is very good although there is no full research to show that but from experience i want to let you know that cinnamon powder does a lot of work and helps with the resistance of insulin in your body what you need to do is just sprinkle it on top of your meal or put them in warm water to take this thing right here helps you this cinnamon everywhere buy them in any store you go mill them and put them in a good jar like this and use them up sprinkle it in your your uh, smoothies use them in your oats in anything even on top of your food like your achar if you want to take them as a porridge and it's naturally sweet so especially diabetic people that have sweet tooth if you put them you don't even need to put any form of sweetener because of the natural sweetness it is so cinnamon 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 then thirdly i talk about having a form of green food in your house like green food are alkalizers they help detox your system and reduce inflammation in your system let me not bore you with everything but just basically have a green leave in your home and mine that i have that i love to have is my as you can see is my bitter leaf this bitter leaf i've washed it and i uh, i don't really wash it thoroughly but i just rinse them up cut them up and then i put them in a nylon like this and put it in the freezer i can bring it out sometimes take some out of it put a little in my soup or uh, I can just take a little out, squeeze the juice out of it and give it to my husband to take. It's very good, it's a strong, potent solution to it. If you know you don't like um, you don't like bitter leaf, which I recommend you should like it for your own good. I can also talk about celery. Celery is also another diuretic, it's also good for the system. I've had this in my home, I'm going to choose this one today. You can see how it looks it has been in my fridge for a while now so all i need to do is just bring it out and juice them later on today so that i can buy a new batch so those are my three inexpensive foods i put in my kitchen i don't want to encourage someone out there 
If you are at a point where you are discouraged as a diabetic person, you are tired of taking drugs, you are tired of the frustration that comes with diabetes, I want you to stick with me. I'm going to share with you my life and the things I did to overcome diabetes. Remember, in living a life as a diabetic person, you can reverse it, you can stabilize it, and you can have control over it. I love you. See you in my next video. Bye.